been a while since we did a video. Um, there's no there's no pool or anything like that, but um, the important thing is that it's very peaceful here. Mm. It's quite it's nice. Ex except all those birds chirping, and it's just such a lovely sound. Our spot is wonderful. It's huge. Got uh, yeah, a nice tree here. Giant spot. Absolutely giant spot. It goes from those things over there to pretty much that thing over there. Yeah, we could actually park this thing sideways in this spot. Yeah, we could park it sideways in this spot. Our truck, there's room for several cars in here. We put two of them in here side by side. There's a really nice clubhouse and um, it's a lovely location. It's absolutely beautiful. And it's about, what, 10 degrees cooler? Oh, than, yeah. than down in the desert. Hi there. Oh, with that cute little dog. Cute little dog over there. End of another great season in Quartzsite in the long-term visitor area in La Posa South and uh, the rains really brought a lot of the greenery back and it's absolutely gorgeous. Stormed and rained a lot yesterday. Somebody walking around back here. We um, ended up leaving a few days after the deadline on um, April 15th. We um, had way too much stuff in our tent and it just was it took us probably I don't know a week longer to pack up than we thought it was also really windy and we were waiting for a nice calm day to take the wind turbine down so we finally got it all together and out of there but if you want to stay past April 15th you need to buy a $75 summer permit or you can pay by the day um, until the end of April and it is $15 a day or $7.50 if you have a um, pass. I think it's the America the Beautiful Pass or something like that. Um, they're really nice people in the office. Um, let us know what it was and I, I'm sorry I can't remember <laughs> what they said it was. So uh, we stayed a few extra days. We got our wind turbine taken down. We headed down to Algodonas to meet up with family. In Mexico and it was a lot of fun and from there we headed out to um, this great boondock spot uh, just about I don't know five to seven miles from the Ketchin Casino. We will likely be staying at Tradewinds all summer long and leaving in the fall to head back down south again to one of the long-term visitor areas and just kind of hop around a little more. My feeling on it and Mike's feeling is um, that it's a fantastic deal, but we also want to use our, um, our kayak. So um, we'll be hopping around to some different lake areas and, and doing that. And I just, uh, I like to travel more. I don't want to settle down into one spot and we ended up doing that last winter because Mike was working. Um, he worked out at the Love's Tire Shop, um, Bustin' Tires, and um, so we were able to replace a lot of things, fix a lot of things, and it worked out really well for us. Um, this year, I think we're just going to kind of hop around a little more and, um, you know, do more exploring. So I'm really excited about that. <laughs> <laughs> of course, we'll meet up with family in either Laughlin or Lake Havasu as everybody 
um, comes back down from the north. Uh, the snowbirds, <laughs> when they come back down from the north, we'll meet up, and from there, we're just going to kind of head out and explore. It's going to be a fun year. And I'm glad to be back doing some videos again. It's been a really nice long break. It's a lot of hard work and um, it's, a, it's a really good way to be creative. So it's, it's been a lot of fun. Seahawks. Oh, wow. That's pretty. Very pretty. I like that pink. Very pretty. Very pretty. There are the fosters all in a row. Why is some spot so slippery on the bottom of my shoe? Oh. Some spots are wet. There's some water somewhere. It's Bridget, Carissa, Della, my dad Don, and Kristen. Cheryl and I the black sheep. I don't know. Yeah, why. well, Tammy stole our title. Here comes Paul and Mike for the black sheep. Is it going to have a camera? Are you going to eat it? Here you go, baby. Is it going to have it? Oh, look at the months, months, months. Mama, months, months, months. You've got to have lunch too. Aren't you cute? Munch, munch, munch. We don't have any food nice where piece. we are. Look Here's a nice piece that. right oh. here. Oh. oh, look at that. Aren't you cute? I wish I had some grapes because they really love those. And watermelons too. Oh, yeah. And you had one. Oh, look, and you can't eat that. My neighbor Sorry. has one that's the size of a car tire. Wow. Yeah, he lives next door. I picked, I had to pick him up and put him back in his enclosure one day, and I could barely lift him. Hi there. Oh, I love you too. I do. It's a gimbal. Well, who do you think I have a camera in my house that sees what my dogs are doing when I'm here? Okay. Am I supposed to talk into it? Turn it around. Oh. This way. To see what everyone else. Oh, I see. Well, I don't see. I can't see anybody. No, that's a GoPro. It doesn't have a. We don't you don't have need to. It. Somehow, I'm not impressed. <laughs> <laughs> I don't that's okay. think I need one. We're going to be on You were already on YouTube on our channel. <laughs> when you came to Lockland. Oh, you are? <laughs> yeah, you've been Oh, we just been passing it around. Yeah. Just short little video. So, yeah, you're on YouTube. To everybody. And everybody said, You haven't oh, gotten a million here. Yeah. Picture of the gun on your uh, with your mouth on the barrel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there you go. There you go. It's even better. It's oh, look at the shot the glasses. Hold up a shot glass. Yeah. That's cool. They're cool. Look at that. Oh, neat. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's, 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 that's a nice, nice bar set. Nice. We stayed overnight at the kitchen 
and normally that's ten dollars to stay now it used to be free but it, um, since there was no one there and it was not in season we didn't have to pay anything we just stayed overnight and the next day we headed out to uh, Sidewinder Road And you can find that spot on freecampsites.net. Um, I think Campendium may also have it. And uh, there's just a lot of spots out there on Sidewinder and Oglesby, Barney Oldfield Road. Um, just be careful you're not on someone's private property. Um, it's, a, it's a little hard to tell. It's a little hard to find markers. So we just went where it, it looked like a lot of other RVs had been and uh, it was fantastic. It was um, 101 degrees and we did use our air conditioner but we were also trying to acclimate to the hot weather because we knew we were going to be staying in Arizona for the summer and so after a few days out there we headed north we found a, a really great and well-priced RV park um, in Golden Valley, Arizona, called Trade Winds.